Yes, people, the food governor's active. You can see my big long hair. I'm going to get my hair done right now. And I'm going to get braids for my hair. Or cane rows, I'm not 100% sure yet. But I'm going to get my hair done today. I'm going to show you the process and how the food governor gets his hair done. Straight active, deep in smothering. Yes, people, so I'm just getting my hair done. As you can see, I'm getting the cane rows. I wanted 150, but it's nine at night and it's impossible, it would take till seven in the morning. So I still landed and I'm getting six done. But yeah, I might come tomorrow to get them retaken out and get 150. And I've been charged 1,800 pounds for this because these, these cane rows you can't get anywhere in England. This lady is the best in Birmingham to do your hair. And it's called Hair Amazing Braids in Smethwick. Come check it out, 36A Windmill Lane in Smethwick. Obviously right now, I'm a VIP, so I'm at the home address. But you people will get a proper shop where you can go in. So the lady you want to speak to, her name's Marsha. I'm going to put all the details in the description, how to contact her. Now, she's a specialist for hair, for braids, plaits, cane rows, twists. I'm sure you've seen my twists in my other videos. Baddest twists on the planet. And only some people can do twists, not everybody can. The shop is called Hair Amazing Braids. It's not only a salon, you can just walk in and get hair products. Okay, she's got some of the best homemade oils that she makes um, for hair growth, regrowth if you've got alopecia. marsha has got all kinds of hair accessories, bubbles. Literally, I could go through a thousand products that she's got. But yeah, just come support and come get your hair done if you want to look like the governor. So, if you want a discount, you've got to mention the governor. And if you mention it too late, there'll be no discount. So you've got to mention it straight away that the food governor sent you and they need to get a discount. And make sure you don't come here with any nits. She's got a special lighter right next to her and if she got any nits, your hair's going to get burnt. She makes you bold. So make sure you've got clean hair, shampooed and conditioned before you come. Or well, if you want her to do it, obviously there's extra charges for that, but she'll do that for you. Yes people, I'm active today. I'm in Birmingham. I'm here to do a food review. I'm going to later reveal what the shop is. But yeah, I've got a new hairstyle as you can see. Looking fresh. And um, this is the new governor now. New hairstyle. Gang <laughs> Yes people, so I've landed. I'm outside the shop. It's on Stratford Road. It's called Sammy's. I think it's like a southern fried chicken shop. Not been here before. Never heard of it much. But um, we're going to try it out today. See what I think of it. I'm going to compare it to what the best out there, what is it? The mainstream, not the best, but the mainstream one is KFC. We're going to see if it's good enough. Um, Sammy, yeah. If you want this hairstyle, shout me. I'll send my private hairdresser over to you. And we'll get some prices sorted out and see what they can do for you. And let me tell you people one thing. Any shop that I go to, I definitely do investigate before I go. So I've had a look at their burgers. They've got some big, chunky burgers. But then the problem is that if you've got big, chunky burgers and good looking food, if we don't taste right, that's when I get f***ed off. So that's one thing that has to be right. Has to look, has to taste better than it looks. And if it looks better than it tastes, there's problems. Shop is looking active. Look at this. Can't lie, it's looking fire. Let's get here. I'm a little bit excited today because I'm very hungry. And I can't lie, these wings do look really nice. I told them to make me what you make, 
do me what you want. But I've seen online they've got double burgers, but they made me a single one. So you can't be doing that to the food governor, definitely not. Or is it a double? No, it's a single. Well, if you're watching this, Sammy's, I'm not going to go back in. Okay, we're not greedy. It's not about being greedy, but you give the best of what you give. Yes, people, they've got the special sauces here. Sammy special sauce. Sammy special mayonnaise. Apparently, it's got some high quality ingredients in there. Standard ketchup. Now, I don't know what to start with today. I might just go in with the fries. Let's get in with the fries. Ooh. Can't lie, yeah? But these fries are paying. You know what? Let's try the, um... Yes, bro. Let's try the special sauce and see if it's actually special. Because I'll be honest here. It looked the same as Rio's. And guess what? It is the same as Rio's. You never get Rio's, Perry Perry. Um, they give you a sauce that's identical to that. So I've had this sauce before. I don't know what it's called. It's like a spicy mayo. Basically, very spicy mayo. Yes, bro, what are you saying? <laughs> Let's get into this mayo. There's some special mayo. Quality ingredients in there. Have to say, it is thick. Mm. Mm, yeah, it's a nice garlic mayo. Nice garlic mayo. These are the wings. Try it raw. Just taste the flavour of the butter. Nice. Crispy. Good meat. But, if I'll be honest to you, it's got the right flavour for a sort of right butter. Good spice, anyone can eat it, it's perfect, but lacking the littlest bit of salt, I would say personally for me in the butter. But the meat's very clean, it's crispy. Let me try another one. Decent. Clean though, clean. One thing I want to say is they're clean. Burger. A little bit hard here. Get this bit. Let me just check what it is, right? A little bit tough, a little bit. It's been warmed up a bit too long. Let's give it a try. Mm. Honestly. That's like a top tier Dixie burger. Honestly, like, it's identical to Dixie's. It's a bit softer. I'd say, it's the better version of Dixie's. And it's really nice, I do like it. 
and just the wings were lacking a bit of salt that's all i'd say otherwise everything's nice the fries are fire clean fresh not redone back in the oil like a lot of shops you go to they get oily look look at these i mean i could eat these all day If I have to give it a review, not a review. I'm gonna give it a score today. And um, overall, I'm gonna give it a solid eight out of 10. It's really, really nice. I'd come here again for that chicken burger, for them fries. Their wings, I tell you, it was a little bit less salt, but that just could be a bad day, okay? Just the butter needed a bit more salt. But at the end of the day, just for that, they got an eight. Otherwise, they would have got a high score. But it's very clean, it's good meat. And I can't deny that. Yeah, so that was a little uh, micro. They gave me this drink. And I'll be honest with you, it's not my favorite. I didn't ask for it, they came out and gave it me. It doesn't matter. Alhamdulillah for everything, but it's lukewarm. And one thing, if you watch my videos, you know it me off when I get drinks that are lukewarm so I'm not happy with that let me just give it a sip it feels like I'm having the most mintiest mocktail in Morocco somewhere literally but yeah it'll do so um, yeah it's a good shop decent if you want to come here and get your ears blown every three to four minutes come down you'll have a nice experience everyone subscribe and everyone that comments, I see all your comments, I love all you people that comment, that are positive. But any, any hater, all you haters to be honest, I love you even more.